Hello fashion seller and welcome to FSB TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video which is going to be slightly different from my other videos is that I am going to be starting a series of subscriber answered questions. So you put a question to me and I answer that in a video format. Now the first question is going to be from Mary Sinclair and it's about sleeves. Now her concern is that she's not sure about the hang of the sleeve, you know, if she puts the sleeve in wrong, how can you tell whether you put it in, in the right way or the wrong way? So I just wanna clear up one or two things so that will help the rest of the FSB community in order to make sure that they are inserting their sleeves in correctly. Now the sleeve I'm going to be talking about is going to be the setting sleeve and what a setting sleeve is, is a sleeve that is added into the, arm, the, the armhole of a, of a garment, whether it's a shirt, a blouse, a jacket or a coat. Now the shaping of the sleeve is going to be important, so we're talking about the head of the sleeve. So I've just done this little diagram here of a sleeve. And um, what I'm going to be talking about is the head of the sleeve. So this is going to be the upper section of the sleeve around here. So um, Mary's concern was that her sleeve was hanging a little bit towards the back. And um, she's also missed up the notches of um, the sleeve. So she's not sure if she's inserting it in the right way, the front and the back, because there is a front and a back to the sleeve. So with my little diagram here, I'm going to kind of show you, or kind of going to show you um, how to identify some little tips to identify the right and wrong side if you've forgotten to add your notches. But one of the most important things about the hang of a sleeve is to make sure it's on the straight of grain. Now, here can be a, a little bit confusing is that if you have your notches on there and all your pattern markings are correct, if you haven't placed that, sit, that that sleeve pattern onto the straight grain of your fabric and you make sure that grain is straight, you're going to have problems with the hang. It doesn't matter how beautifully sewn it is, it will not hang the way you want it to hang. So the first thing you need to make sure is it's on the straighter grain of your fabric. So And that will help with the hang of your sleeve. Right, I'll just quickly cut this out so that you get a, a better, a hopefully a better um, understanding of the anatomy of a straight sleeve. Now, as I said, it's going to be a setting sleeve and it is concerning that we are making sure that the head of the sleeve is cut out correctly and there is a curve. Now you should have three markings, the basic markings on a sleeve pattern. You're going to have the straighter grain which is indicated here with a notch at the top of the sleeve and then you're going to have um, notches on each side of the curve. So the notch on the top of the sleeve, that's going to be an indicator that you align that to the shoulder seam and that will hang correctly because that will be an indicator also for the straight grain of the sleeve. So I'll just quickly mark that in, just to show you there. And in order to make sure that you're working with the inserting the sleeves incorrectly, the right, um, the, the front and also the back of the sleeve. Now, the trick is to, if you don't have any notches, is to fold your sleeve in half, like so. And if I turn it round like there, you should find that the front of the sleeve here, in this here area here, will be slightly less than the, the other side. Now the side that is slightly less is going to be the front of the sleeve and where there is much more, a little bit more fullness in that shaping there, that's going to be the back of the sleeve. So I'll just draw that in. 
so that you get a good indication of what that's like. So you should see you should see this the red marking and the black marking. Now on sewing patterns the way they indicate the front and the back is going to be you're going to have the front is going to be indicated by one notch and the back is going to be indicated by two notches. So it's going to be one for the front and one for the back. And that's how you're going to be inserting it into your armhole of your garment because you should have one notch in your garment and for the front and then two notches in the back. And then you have a notch, a third notch at the top of the sleeve for the seam or the shoulder. And that also indicates the straight grain of your sleeve. Now, as I said before that, if you are sewing in that sleeve beautifully and it still is hanging a little bit to the back, it can be because you haven't put the sewing pattern on a straight of grain. And there really isn't that much you can do with it. You can play with it a little bit, but it depends on how much that swing is going towards the back. Um, you may just have to recut those sleeves. So I hope that answers your question, Mary. And um, if you have any questions that you want me to answer in a video format, please put those in the comments. Um, if you have any comments that you wish to make, please do so. Please give this a thumbs up if you like this video. Do share it with your friends and I will see you next time.